Switching from summer to the start of school isn't just keeping students and families busy. Teachers are stocking shelves, organizing classrooms, and buying up education essentials so they're ready for your kids when that first bell rings. KIMT News 3's Maureen Dudley is getting a lesson in how to create a comfor comfortable but creative classroom at John Adams Middle School. With summer coming to an end, many teachers are getting their classrooms set up. I spoke with a teacher here at John Adams who's preparing her classroom a little early. Megan Beatty is a multilingual teacher at John Adams Middle School. She teaches kids who speak English as a second language. Middle school is an odd time for any kid and it can be a tough time. And especially for kids who are coming from other cultures to feel like they find a place here. And so my hopes always are that I can be a part of that journey and helping them not only with their English, but helping them find their place in a middle school setting. Beatty tells me there's a strategy to setting up the classroom more than just organizing desks and putting books on a shelf. You're always looking for spaces for kids, spaces for kids to do teamwork, spaces for kids to find that individual quiet space, space for kids to decompress, space for kids to, to play a game. And so over here, I've got kind of like the reading nook going on. We have table groups that we're going to have for teams of kids over here. We'll have intervention sections over here where teachers can work one-on-one -on -one with kids. She says there's still a lot of work left to prepare, but she can't wait to see eager students in a few weeks. Is my room ready for kids to be back? Not even close. Is my heart ready to see them? Absolutely. Beatty says this year she spent about $100 on new things for the classroom and the PTSA has helped in the past with covering the costs of classroom supplies for teachers through fundraising. In Rochester, Maureen Dudley, KIMT News 3. I love our teachers. They are just so amazing and a lot of work goes into decorating those classrooms. RPS high school freshmen will be reporting to class August 26th, then upperclassmen and middle school students will head back on the 27th. Elementary kids have their first day on the 28th. 